uh, this short video covers how to enroll participant users in a course. I'm assuming that participant users already have a matrix account which you created earlier. We're starting from the admin dashboard. If you're not on the admin dashboard, pause the video and go there now. Okay, so on the admin dashboard, the courses tile, click the courses tile and you get a list of courses that are in the system. We're going to advance leadership today to put some users on there. And if we look in the left hand column of the course, we will see participants. If you don't see participants in there, contact LX and we'll get that sorted. Top right, there is an add button. You can see we've already got some users in there, a test user belonging to me and three that I put on a few minutes ago. We're going to add some more. Add. We use the people picker. And we go to our spread, just pop over to our spreadsheet and look for Flynn and Nicholas. We're going to put them on. So here we go, Flynn. Search for all the Flynns in the system. I bet there won't be many. There's one. There she is. We move her across to the right. Nicholas. I bet there won't be many of those. Nicholas. Yes. Nick Saskia Nicholas. There's a great thing about handling users in a manual way like this. You know, automated systems are all very well. But here, you get to know your students' names. And um, it's funny how they soak into the back of your mind. And when you get an email from somebody or a call from somebody, you go, oh, hang on, I've seen that name. And it makes you much better as a support agent uh, for having done the manual handling. Okay, now we've got two new users for the course over in this right-hand side now. So we select them. And just down there, we add them. Just bottom right there, add. The dialog closes and we're uh, in the participants list. And there they are. We've got Bell, Cooper, Flynn, Nicholas, and Peterson and the test user. Now, I'm not going to put them all on because it'll get boring, but I'll do two more just so a little bit of repetition. Yeah. Add. People picker. Who should we have now? Rolleston and Stewart. Okay, Rolleston. Rolly, you should be able to just do that. I would imagine, you know, uh, you just put in a few first letters and the system will find it, especially if it's a slightly unusual name and you only need to type about three letters. Uh, click that little chap to move her over to the right. Um, I've now forgotten what the other one was called Stuart. Stu. Yep, here she is. Check the box. Move her over to the right. Select the pair of them and add them. There you go. Easy. It is actually dead easy, isn't it? <laughs> Some, gosh. <laughs> Thank heaven some things are. Okay, bye.